we're really just sort of open and exploring our options right now. Planning for the future of Youngstown and Mahoning County's library system, consolidating three branches is an option the library is looking at. Those branches, Struthers, Camel, and Brownlee Woods, are just a few minutes away from each other. Now, nothing is set in stone for this possible consolidation. 27 First News Weekend anchor Julie Bursick talked with the library's executive director to learn a timeline if the process happens. Julie tells us now what she learned. Yeah, branch consolidation is something that's been talked about for years now. The executive director tells me it's actually been in the last two strategic plans. The library says it is open to hearing from the community, and it's important to note no decision has been made yet. Today I did go to two of the branches that are part of the possible consolidation process. Gloria is a familiar face at the Camel branch of the public library. She's been working here almost 10 years. Margaret Bryan is at the library at least twice a month. I usually get movies. My husband gets books. He reads constantly. Consolidating the Camel Library with the Brownlee Woods and Struthers branches is being considered by the library. Some of the reasons, the locations are close to each other, the buildings are older, and not as many people use the services at the branches. What we'd like to do is have a better building with longer hours and be able to offer really those modern amenities to the public, but in a way that makes sense for us financially and from a usage standpoint. Margaret isn't concerned about the possible well, no, consolidation. The, the Camel Library is convenient for her, but she does go to the other branches. If the library goes with a consolidated branch, it will be a brand new library. That means selecting a new site. The library says it's talking with community leaders and groups. It's also keeping a file of possible locations that have been suggested. As well as looking at other possibilities for the areas where the consolidated branch doesn't end up, what might be possibilities for us to continue to make sure we have service to those locations. As far as the funding to build, the library says it's been planning for this. So the executive director also tells me another possibility is that one of those consultants could actually just recommend renovating a branch instead of building a new one. She also stressed to me consolidation is not about cutting back on staff at the library branches. All right, Julie, thanks.